working on the rabbit tree. We're adding some wire, some outlets, power for the fans because in case you guys didn't know, it's hot. Texas is really, really hot right about now. And we have a bunch of bunnies that uh, need to be cooled off, cooled down, and kept cool. So we will be putting a couple of fans in here. So the goal is to put at least two outlets in here. We're running a power line from an external breaker panel. So it shouldn't be that hard. However, I am accident prone. I always hurt myself or I get stung by wasps, bees, mosquitoes, or ants get me. Or some type of bug always gets me. Well, this time, I got myself. I got myself uh, uh, with a piece of uh, tin. I was trying to pull that wire, and I knew it was gonna happen. But I'm not the wiser, so it got me. It got me. And, uh, my wife tried to fix it up, y'all. My finger's not deformed, I promise you. It's it's not. But um, she put some stuff on it, and, and this is what she did. So, I mean, she's trying, you know. And typically, I would have just, like, you know, thrown a piece of paper towel and some electric tape, you know. Because why not? That's how I roll. But anyway, guys, this is what we're trying to do. We're trying to keep these guys cool. So, we got a bunch of bunnies. And some of these guys, and again... I'm going to throw this out there. These are meat rabbits, y'all. We eat these, okay? We eat these. Well, not these right here because these are the does. However, a bunch of these are going to go into our freezer. Some of these. Some of those. Most of those. Some of these. And some of those. Again, we raise these guys for meat purpose. These are the bucks put a sink out here for my wife and these are all my tools because i just have tools everywhere and we're using that kind of fan so we got first outlet box is going to go right here and we're going to mount that fan somewhere in here probably probably right here and blow that way okay guys so this is what i've done so far uh with the help of my wife we um, we ran the power. I still need to put a, the covers are in my truck. I just got home after another long day at work. So these two mamas, I'm gonna run an, an extension cord from there over here. We're gonna put another fan here and we're gonna put a something here to block off. Well, probably can't do it because if I do, then I'm gonna block off that fan. I don't wanna do that. But again, she's probably the, out of all of them, she's probably the hottest one. Because then we got these guys over here, they're doing okay. Like I said, they're constantly being checked on, making sure that their waters are filled. Food, not too concerned, but water is the biggest thing. Now again, these guys are getting nice. It feels great in here. And then this one right here, we got a fan going straight in here. And, um... My son will come out here and what he does is he wets their ears because that's that's the way they cool down. So the best way to you know get you some water and just do this to them. And again, these are the Tamuk rabbits, y'all, so they are very, very heat resistant. I mean look, look the guy just hanging out there behind his mama. And the, that other one. So they're they're doing good, y'all. They're doing good. It's been 112. No, this is this is this is great here. Actually, it actually feels pretty good. I I was uh, here the other day and it was pretty hot. I mean, we have a tin roof, so but it's it's well ventilated. So as you can see, guys, it's hot out here, and um, I, I'm surprised. I'm surprised of how well those uh, those fans are working in there. They are definitely moving some airflow, and they're keeping those bunnies slightly cooler than, uh, you know, this 100 plus degrees out here. It's not that bad in there. It's definitely better. That was a, that was a good upgrade for us, and it's going to be, I wouldn't call it a game changer as far as what we're trying to accomplish, 
but it's definitely a step towards that because it was hot in there uh, last week, and that's definitely that's definitely better for them. So we're gonna we're gonna gonna continue improving this for them, and um, we're definitely not make we're ne we're definitely not breeding anymore. I think the last one that we did was uh, was a month ago, and a couple of mamas just went ahead and had their babies uh, this week. So we're done. We're done. We're, um, like I said, my wife has mentioned it before. She's done it before, and we lost one of our mamas, and she will never do that again. Because just because you can doesn't make it right, you know. Um, because yes, we understand that that we are raising these guys, and and we're you know it's extra protein for us or, or a different type of protein for us, but it's not it's not fair to them. So. Um, that's it, y'all. Uh, I'll, I'll continue doing these little videos. I'm not an electrician by all means, um, but, but I kind of sort of do know a little bit because I work in air conditioning and heating. So I, I know, I know a little bit of the, you know, the power supply basically. So, um, I didn't show you guys how I did everything. Cause again, I'm not trying to teach anybody in here. I'm just showing you what we're doing and it's working for us. So again, thank you guys. You have a good one.